this is the first time you're seeing me in New York. I'm here with Natty. Hi. I'm sitting here anxiously waiting for this story. Oh, okay. I don't know if I've ever said this, but Nat like loves to cry at like old people stuff. I thought you were just going to say old men and I was like, we got to preface that. No, no, that no. Sounds a little weird. No, no, no. She <laughs> loves like anytime I'm on TikTok and I see like, an, you know, an old couple walking on the beach, I send it to Nat. She cries like within I, four seconds. I don't cry except for when it has to deal with old people. No, Nat, you probably would have been crying had you been for sitting sure next to this man. Okay, so I, <laughs> I'm telling the story of the guy sat by on the flight. So the, the plane setup is like two, four, and two. So it's just oh, me and him. Oh, you a fat plane. So it's just me and him sitting together. <laughs> so like right when I sit down, you know I'm not a talker. No. But I did talk to this old man the whole good. time. So I sit down, I get my blanket out, and I like put it on my lap, and he's like, good night. <gasps> and just like immediately start talking to me. So I'm like, all right, we've got a talker on our hands. So I'm like, yeah, whatever. And so then like we don't really talk that much, and then the like flight goes on. And then he's like, um, I pull my laptop out because I was gonna start editing. And he's like, oh, what do you do? You live in LA? And I'm like, yeah. And he has the thickest New York accent. Like, <laughs> so, like, he's like. Did he have gray hair? Yeah. Okay. And he is 80 years old, just to preface. He's 80 years old. No, you're going, you're going, <laughs> you're going to die. I, like, I wish you took a photo. I wish I did too. I'm like, I need him on Facebook or something. I wish I would have, like, saved this man. So he's like, sitting there, he's talking to me, and then he's asking me what I'm coming. I'm like, it's my friends. Like, Basically, first time in New York, we're doing a little girls trip, and he's like, oh, so I'm like, what are you going to New York for? Because he lives in California, but he's born and raised in New York. Okay. He said, he's like, oh, once a year, every year, me and my friends, we go to Montauk, and we do like a guys trip, and they're his four friends from first grade. He's been friends with them since first grade. That and is they so cute. And yeah, that's what he's flying out for. And he's going and he's like getting in his like car and going to Montauk and staying at like a house with them and they're gonna like go fishing and do all this stuff. And I was like, that is the cutest thing I've ever actually heard of in my whole life. So like, I'm just like, <laughs> I'm so distraught. No, so then we're like talking and like, whatever, chit chatting. And then the food thing comes by and I'm like, oh, can I see what to buy? Can I get some food? And they like give me the chart and I'm like, I'm just gonna get like cheese and crackers or something. And he's like, I'll buy it for you. I'll buy it for you. Don't worry about it. And I'm like, no, oh, like it's okay. And he was like, no, I want to buy this for you. Like you're, you're like my granddaughter. You remind me of my granddaughter. And I'm like, oh, oh my God. God. I'm like, okay. So he buys me my, he buys me my little thing or you whatever. You better lick the fuck the plate clean, bro. No crumbs. No, I was like, I have to eat all of this because this man just bought it for me. So I'm sitting there, I'm eating it. He's like chit-chatting. He pulls his phone out and he's showing me so many photos of his grandkids and his daughter. He was married, I can't remember for how long, but his wife passed away 12 years ago. So now he's remarried. And I'm like, I'm just like this man. I think he's the cutest. Like he was just telling me his whole life story and he was so cute. And then the real, the, the, the best part of it was, you know I don't sleep on planes. Right. And so I'm like sitting there and I am just like kind of like my head is like to the side or whatever. And I have my headphones on like my big headphones. And he goes, he like taps me on the shoulder and I took my headphones off and he was like, you can lay on my shoulder if you want. <laughs> And then cried the whole time. He was literally like, he, and then he just kept being like, you just remind me so much of my granddaughter. It's like, you're my granddaughter. I'm like, I'm actually dead. I was like, but I'm not. I'm not your granddaughter. So it's like, cute. you're so sweet and you're so cute, but I'm not going to lay on your shoulder. No, I could never. I absolutely but. won't lay on your shoulder. But thank you for offering. And he wasn't creepy. No. Like, it wasn't. It wasn't weird, like it wasn't like an old man being like, you wanna, like, he was so <laughs> sweet. Like, yeah, 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 it wasn't like that, it was so cute. Like, come on. I go to bed again, good night. Go to sleep. 9 a.m. and it's 
raining outside, but we're about to get up and go get coffee and breakfast. Hello everyone, it's the next morning. Nat and I slept a good 11 hours. It was crazy, we were in comas. We were in full comas, uh, we went to sleep and we tried to like beat jet lag because we went to sleep at like 7 LA time, but like 10.30 here. So anyway, now we're up. I'm wearing this outfit, which I literally wore yesterday when we went and got pizza, but obviously I just wore it to go get pizza. So I was like, let's just rewear this today and wear all black. It's so rainy, so we need to go get some umbrellas. And then we're gonna go get breakfast because we're starving, but we're both in all black. And I just feel like I'm gonna end up wearing this jacket over everything now that we're here because it's just a little rainy. We're walking to breakfast. We got coffee. New York. That you I know wanted. those are the umbrellas we wanted, but we're walking to coffee and this is Carrie's apartment from Sex in the City. How cute now we is that? Have to take pictures. So now we're gonna go over there. Look how cute it is. We're giving Matt the full the full tour, but we just got the best coffee ever. I'm holding it in my arm, but it's so rainy. And now that we got coffee, we're gonna go get some breakfast. Good morning to our breakfast and our shared food. I have a feeling we're gonna share every meal here. And then we're gonna go get, what is it? Magnolia Bakery, banana, banana, banana pudding. Cream pie. Banana, pudding. <laughs> banana cream pie. <laughs> banana pudding is what's coming after this. Hello, everyone. <laughs> Jail. Keaton just goes, I need to shut up. And then immediately, hello. And then I start vlogging. I just can't stop singing. Like throughout the day, it's just random songs that come into my brain. And I'm just like, yeah, it's just like, if you see me and you're trying to. Anyway, everyone, um, we just, you know, went through a little hurricane outside and then came back. We walked like literally two miles back to our hotel in the rain. And I mean, it was an adventure. But now we need a little break because we're sweating. No, dripping. We're dripping sweat. Just because it's like when you're walking so much, you know that feeling when you're like fast walking and then you stop and it's just like the heat takes over. We just had a full on heat flash, so I stripped down. And now we're in the hotel room taking a break, but we went to Magnolia Bakery. We have to show. We went to Magnolia Bakery and we got the banana pudding. It's oh my i can taste it i literally it's so good nat has never had this i love banana you're gonna you're going to love this is it still is it cold yeah it's still cold it's so I'm good so i feel excited. like i need to vlog your first experience okay. but we're basically gonna chill here um eat banana pudding and then we'll go back out and do some shopping it's yeah. what time is it it's only one yeah so like we went out Honestly, I'm, that's kind of sick of us i know we went out we had breakfast we yeah. got coffee we walked oh and we went to a bookstore yeah, she i bought got a, book. a book she got a little book and then we got banana pudding and then we walked back and now we're gonna take a little mini break eat our banana pudding and then that's pretty much it that's my reading it's I'm, your anniversary Oh yeah, it's my reading anniversary. I feel like I should save my reading for tonight. But it's my <laughs> reading anniversary because- She's gonna take it to the restaurant with us. At this time last year was when I went and first bought a book and was like, I think I need to get back into reading. And I went and I bought It Ends With Us. And I was I like- I was gonna say, what was it? Yeah, it was It Ends With Us. I went and bought a couple and then I bought that. And I was like, oh my God, I love reading again. And now that's all she does. And now it's taken over my life, so. It's an addiction. Yeah, so that's where we're at right now. But anyway, just giving you a little update. Bye. We are James. Yeah, turn that off. You know what I always wonder? Do you think like other people say James the way that we say James? No, <laughs> no. I don't think anyone does because sometimes when I say it, people say James. They're so confused. No one gets it. No. And I think it's only like a our friend group thing. It's just us. It's from the Wendy Williams meme, okay? And yes. She says, what was that? James. James. <laughs> so now anytime something is like weird or off, we say James. James. Okay, we're trying. Yeah. Magnolia Bakery banana pudding. I've never had it and I'm so excited. Look at that. It's so Look at those bananas. Is that like? That's a vanilla wafer. <laughs> yeah, so just like get a good scoop and then get the vanilla, the wafer in there. Oh my God, like when this touches my tongue. One. Can I eat it? Okay. Cheers. Cheers. The only thing, this is my only commentary. It should be colder. I normally eat it when it's cold. Fair. And it's a little lukewarm. I don't even mind it, but, but I wouldn't so even good. know the difference. <gasps> Ski. This is giving me like the energy I need. No, what? It's so good. Do we have a fridge in But there? I'm still, girl. <laughs> <laughs> James. No. Okay. This is just like 
I'm giving it an eight seven. <gasps> okay. Mm -hmm. What's the reasoning? Because it's really hard to achieve a nine. <clears throat> oh. Okay. And I think if it was cold, it, it, was it would cold. hit an it would hit a nine one. Yeah, if it was cold, it'd be like a ten. I yeah. Swear. It's so good. Well, that was fun. That was great. <laughs> Loved that. Ooh, the brown is cute. We're at our first stop. Brown's We're in Aritzia. Me. The brown is yeah, really this cute. This is our first stop. This is our first shopping stop. So I've got two items and they're really groundbreaking. I've got a black <laughs> skirt and a white top. So nothing to see here, folks. I don't either. We're done. Do you want to see if they have a different bra for under there? I just cannot find the bra. Let's go. Under there. I would think I'm wearing like a... Like a, a what? Giving like Oh yes. Yeah, black and blue ones like Well, we'll go somewhere else. <laughs> We're taking a break in Glossier, Nat bought something, shopping away. We'll give you a haul when we get yeah, back. I'm only buying things for other people. Yeah, she's bought everything for other people. I bought a couple things. Yeah, they're all did. they're all white. Perfect really for sad. fall. But uh, I'll give you a haul when we get back home. We're back from shopping. We went and had our Soho day. We went to a bunch of stores. I'll give you a little haul. I didn't get anything groundbreaking, you guys. There wasn't anything else really after. And I give you white t-shirts. Literally three <laughs> white items, but you know what? It is what it is. But okay, you guys, I was telling you about that Free People shirt and how I found the long sleeve version on the website. They had it in the store here. So I bought the long sleeve one. And I think while I'm here, I'm gonna wear this one instead of the short sleeve one that I packed just because I really like this. So I'll show you guys that when I style it. But that's the first white t-shirt I got. I went to Brandy and I don't have a plain white baby tee. So I just got a white baby tee. I know it's shocking that I don't have one. I have white plain t-shirts, but they're like long. So I wanted one that was just like a simple baby tee, which I always just like go to Brandy for that. And then I saw these at Brandy and I thought they were cute. And they're just like little white boxer type shorts, but they have stripes on them. I don't know if you guys can tell because the lighting is washing these out, but they've got little like pinstripes on them. And I just thought they'd be so cute. These I can wear like to sleep in or style them or something. I think they're so fun. So those are literally the three items that I got today, just all white, but they're so cute. So now we're back at the hotel. We've got like an hour and a half or so before we have um, dinner. We're gonna go to American Bar tonight. I'm excited because the menu looks so good and so delicious. So now we're just hanging out in the hotel, taking a breather. We we're walked. laying. Yeah, we're laying. We're um, laying. And we're about to read, actually, is what we're about to do. I'm about to sit here. We're both gonna sit and read for a little bit before we go to dinner. We just needed a break. Honestly, how many steps did we walk today? Can oh, you see? Oh, let me look. 13,000. That's pretty crazy, right? Yes, yeah, it's, yeah. Okay. We're not leaving the apartment until 11.30. That's what we did today. We're gonna go to dinner, um, and that's it. I'll update you guys after our rest. Hello, everyone. We have revived ourselves, and now we're changed. We're gonna go to dinner. I'll give you a fit check. I don't know, there's like nowhere in this place to set up the camera to show you my outfit. This is the outfit. It's not bad lighting. It's not? No, you look stunning. Ah, okay. <laughs> Okay, so this is my outfit. I've got my jeans, my little boots, my new shirt from Free People that I bought, my belt from, no, I love the trash can, I keep it. I am wearing my belt from Heaven Mayhem, and then I put on a ton of jewelry, and then I wore my little, okay, well, they're down here. They were supposed to be up here the whole time. I have my little straps on, and this is my outfit. Now it's turn. Okay, so I'm actually doing the eight ball sweater. So cute. So excited. And then just a little slip dress and then some high booties. I want to get new booties. And then slick back and then a black bag. Cute. Oh, that's okay. it. <laughs> Back from dinner, wow, I look like I'm wearing a mask. I've got a very dark neck and a real, and a real white what face. What is that? Is? No, why does it look like that? Oh, it's the wall. Is it? If that's not what I look like right no, in person, right? No, that wall, right? I was like, oh, what's that. covering that? Oh, so I do look like this in person. Yes. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> um, <laughs> Anyway, I'm about to go into a food coma and actually pass out. We had the best 
food ever. I always see people eating at American Bar and I'm always like, oh, I gotta go there. But like, I don't know. My expectations weren't really that high. I was just like, this will be good. I thought it would just be like a, a good meal. Yeah, and it was a great meal. Great. It was so good. We got pasta. We got and lobster. <laughs> peanut salad, which was insane. So pigs good. And, and then we got pigs in a blanket. And then we got the most delicious sundae. I know I showed you guys, but like, you guys, that Sunday was so incredible. My contacts were I have ready. something to say about it. This Sunday, it's from Sunset Tower Hotel in LA, and they're known for their Sunset Tower, or their Tower Sundays, and it's the best thing in the world, and they have it specifically at American Bar, because it's like the Tower Bar Sunday, and I think that they must have the same owner. Yeah. But Keaton and I mucked it up. It was insane. No, it was so good. And also, if you like to drink, they had the most wild lychee martini ever. Yeah, she was getting lit. I was not. <laughs> yeah, no, so we absolutely devoured the Sunday, and now we're back, and it's like 9.30. It's 9. It's 9. It's 9 p.m. <laughs> um, and now we're back, and we're about to play cards, and then we're gonna read our books, and we're gonna snuggle. And that's pretty much it. I think I'm gonna end this first half of the vlog here. I'm vlogging the whole rest of the trip, so I will post those whenever I'm able to edit them. I, my hard drive actually like broke the cord oh, it for 10. it. It's 10. Oh, it's 10? Yeah. Oh, okay, I don't feel that old. <laughs> um, yeah, my actual cord for my hard drive broke, so I had to order a new one to this hotel to try and edit these vlogs for you guys because I couldn't get them to upload. So anyway, you guys don't care. This is the end of the vlog. I have lots more New York content coming. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok. We're posting some funny stuff on TikTok, so you're really missing out if you're not over there. Um, but that's pretty much it.